Hello! Welcome students! This is my online class. I'm Teacher She. Enjoy watching while learning! Today, we are going to discuss about sets. Ano nga ba ang set? Set is a well-defined group of objects that shares a common characteristics. Always remember that sets are named by any capital letter. So you can use any letter in the English alphabet, ha? Next, each object in a set is called element of the set and it is denoted by this symbol. And lastly, element can only be written once and are enclosed by braces and separated by commas. Now look at the example. This is teacher She. She write down all the even numbers from 1 to 20, that is 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, and 20. And this is John. He was assigned to bring picture of any balls that found in their house. And lastly, this is Nicole. She was asked what color can be seen in a rainbow. And she told us to enumerate them faster, you just think the acronym Roy G. Viv, which means R for red, O for orange, Y for yellow, G for green, B for blue, I for indigo, and V for violet. What you have observed in the given example? Did you know that that three examples are the example of set? Yes, that is a set. So let's go back to example number 1, which is Teacher She write down all the even numbers from 2 to 20. So we can call this set as a set of all even numbers from 2 to 20. Consisting the element of 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20. So they are well-defined set because obviously this element shares a common characteristics. Now next is John. So we can name the set as a set of balls brought by John because this is the balls that he brought from their house. That is basketball, baseball, soccer ball, tennis ball, and the volleyball. So this is a well-defined set because you listed all the elements. Lastly, this set, we can name it as a set of colors in a rainbow. And the elements of this set are red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet. This set is also a well-defined set. Now let's try to answer this. Can you make a set of a beautiful teachers? No. Why no? Because your list may be different from mine. Your idea of beauty is maybe different with others. So this is not a well-defined set. How about set of numbers less than 10? Hmm. What kind of numbers? Even numbers? Add numbers? Counting numbers? So dapat be specific. So this is not well-defined. However, if we can change it to set of counting numbers less than 10, yan! Pwede na natin ibigay yung elements niya which is from 1 to 9. Another one, a basket of different delicious fruits. Hmm? Delicious fruits. Pwede masarap sa'yo, sa akin hindi. So, this is also a not well defined. Again, kailangan specific. So, change natin to. A basket of different fruits that the name starts with letter A. So, kaya na natin ibigay yan, which is atis, avocado, and apple. Let's go back to the first three example. As I said earlier, a set are named by any capital letter. And the elements can only be written once and are enclosed by braces and separated by a commas. So, in this set, we can just simply write the capital letter here with the equal sign and enclose the elements with braces. Use letter A in this problem. Next, I'm going to let B 
with the name of this set. So again, capital letter and enclose it in braces. Same process for the last one. So let's see or any letters in the alphabet and then enclose again in braces. So that's all for today. Next lesson, finite, infinite, and null set. Thank you for watching.